if Alan's a YouTuber, why can't I be a YouTuber? He has all the technology available for me. I mean, it can't be that difficult. He can probably re record all of my content as well. Let's just try it. Hey everybody, welcome to Lisa's YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about Xiaomi's latest device, Mi 10 Pro 5G. Now this thing is a beauty. Wait, he said something after. Q intro. Alrighty, let's get right into it. Shout out to my sister for helping me with that intro. It's always nice when there's a helping hand and she'll be also assisting me in creating this video and showing you guys examples of using this device. Xiaomi has sent me their latest Mi 10 Pro 5G. I know 5G, I can't believe we're in 5G technology right now. They're really pushing innovation forward and I'm super excited about it. Now today's video is to challenge you guys in various different ways and also challenge myself creatively. The entire hashtag is shoot like a pro. And not only just shoot like a pro anywhere, but specifically at home. So how can you get creative at home and utilize a device like this to create really cool videos? Well, this device has features that allow you to do that. In order for you guys to know what those are, we gotta talk about some specs first. So let's get right into it. Here are some noteworthy features related to film and photography. It features a whopping 108 megapixel quad camera with 8K video capabilities. You absolutely heard me right. We're talking about 108 megapixels with 8K video capabilities. My mind just exploded. It captures 2 billion pixels per second and the AI 2.0 allows comprehensive pixel optimization for capturing vivid picture quality. When I saw the video samples that they had on their website, I was just speechless. This thing is incredible. It features four rear cameras. The first is an 8 megapixel 10 time hybrid zoom lens with an aperture of 2.0. It has a 12 megapixel portrait camera with two times optical zoom. It has the 108 megapixel ultra clear primary sensor with the aperture of 1.69. And also has a 20 megapixel ultra wide angle camera, which is great with panoramic view of 117 degrees. The device also has various different video capabilities. It shoots 8K at 30 frames per second. It shoots 4K and 1080p at 30 and 60 frames per second. And it also shoots 720p at 30 frames per second. And of course, let's not forget that front facing 20 megapixel ultra clear camera. This thing is great for taking selfies, you know, travel when you're traveling, when we're able to travel. It's gonna be great for taking those pictures of yourself. It has so many other options available. In this video, we're gonna be featuring a variety of different video features, some of which I'm super excited to cover. All right guys, now that we've talked about the specs, I wanna quickly dive in and talk to you guys about different features that the mobile device offers. The Mi 10 Pro is equipped with really innovative technology, and a lot of the improvements are seen in the video content that you can produce with it. They've actually included a variety of different options for you to select from to create abstract, really fun, and dynamic content. Some of which I'm gonna to talk to you guys about in this video, to be specific, we're gonna discuss five different features that I really think are outstanding. And I'm gonna show you guys examples of each of those features in a home setting where you can shoot like a pro at home and outside uh, once obviously everything changes and you're able to get outside and create amazing content. These features are great to utilize at home and will definitely improve and make your content be more professional. The perfect device that's going to allow you to create high quality content without all the unnecessary things like wires, extensions, cables, and so on and so forth. The first feature I wanna to talk to you guys about is image stabilization. The reason I wanna to talk to you guys about this one is because I think this is the highest quality of image stabilization I've ever seen in a mobile device. They've done an outstanding job with the technology here and the footage is so smooth, it's like buttery smooth. And I shot different types of scenes to really experiment with it. I want to do to really test out its limits in terms of action sports versus non-action sports. Uh, so I had my nephew run around the backyard and climb a tree and get out of a tent and I just saw 
saw how seamless everything flowed and also the how how easy it was to actually work with the phone and not really having to worry about you know n you know jumping over, over around things or having imbalances the phone actually has other options in it that allow you to change the level of image stabilization in your content they have an EIS pro mode which is an option to really enhance the stabilization in the device naturally the phone actually has an image stabilization option that you can turn off and on whenever you want but then in the actual settings of the camera you can go further and choose various different selections to even further the image stabilization. I also wanted to experiment with the phone and really test out its limits outside of the home. So I took my friend to a soccer field and this is the outcome. Feature number two is color focus. Now the device comes with this really unique option of allowing you to take your subject and pop them out of the image. And the way of doing that is by making the background all black and white while making the subject still in color. And it's a very fun and abstract feature to utilize. It creates a little bit more of an artistic approach to your content and I think it really has a lot of benefits, especially if you're someone who's trying to emphasize certain things or you want to create a very dynamic type of video with a friend and you're trying to traveling or whatever you might be doing. At home, I want to utilize this feature in the Luckily my parents home, uh, the backyard faces a, a forest so we got my sister to kind of go around the trail and uh, the footage was awesome. You can really see her pop amongst the, the trees and the forest and everything else. The phone does a really good job in selecting the subject and making sure that nothing in the background is also in the featured image. I also wanted to test out the color focus feature outside of the home so I took one of my friends and we went to Graffiti Alley in downtown Toronto and this is where I really wanted to push the boundaries of the phone. Now we're talking about an environment that is extremely colorful, there's a lot of things happening in the background. I wanted to test out the limits and I was really amazed with how well the phone was able to separate the subject from the background. Take a look. Feature number three is time lapse. Now time lapses, as you guys know, I love and I'm sure many of you do as well. They're a great feature to incorporate in your videos and really make your content look a lot more professional. They're awesome to show processes of doing things like for example, me taking my tent apart in the backyard and putting it away or whether or not you're at home and you're doing work in your office and you wanna show the process of moving things around and incorporate that in your YouTube videos. The phone does a really seamless job of really creating time lapses and I wanted to push the limits with it outside of the home so we actually took it to the streets and I filmed myself driving around downtown Toronto on my Riker and showing the buildings the skyscrapers and how time-lapse can be utilized to show progress from one place to another here's that video so you guys can take a look at it Feature number four, 8K footage. Yes, we finally got into a place where we can incorporate 8K footage on a mobile device. And I can't tell you guys how incredible the actual footage is. I know right now you're looking through it, 
uh, on your YouTube video and it's not the same as seeing 8K footage on an 8K television but uh, we did put it into 4K quality so you guys can see the footage. It's outstanding. The level of detail that the phone is able to capture, the mood, the texture, it's able to really di differentiate colors and you know exposure levels. There's a lot of sensitivity when it comes to color and uh, really making sure that the image is crystal clear. I had my sister go out on, on the rooftop of my parents' place. This is something we used to do growing up where we just sit there and just you know look at the stars or read books and so she was reading a book and I thought you know what this would be a perfect opportunity to test out the 8K quality and so I had her flipping through a book. There was a sunset. It was a beautiful scene. And then I also want to push the limits of it outside of the home because I want to show you guys the you know, options here at home and outside. And outside I took one of my friends uh, just to Lakeshore in downtown Toronto and we really got some really nice detailed shots. Take a look at the footage. Feature number five is the shoot vlog option. Now the shoot vlog option is a really cool new feature that the Mi 10 Pro offers where you can automatically stitch together different video clips and it'll apply transitions based on the options that you select. I think they have about eight or nine different options for you to choose from. You just click on it, you start filming and it'll stitch together different scenes and apply those transitions and even apply the music. It's seamless, super easy to utilize. I tried it with my sister, we made a smoothie at home. Take a look at the video. You'll notice in the video that it automatically makes the transitional cuts and they're so seamless. And the cool thing is that the music is oriented so that the cuts and the matching of the sounds and everything is very, very clean and well done. Uh, now the phone actually has different transitional styles that you can choose from, it's not just that one. And one of the benefits is that if you're a content creator and you're always creating content, you want to be able to create content a lot quicker. This is a really good feature to utilize where you can stitch together different clips and automatically put it together. This is great for IG stories. This is great for even putting into YouTube videos and sharing content with your friends. Uh, you know, rather than filming hours and hours of content, you're filming the best parts of different scenes and the phone will do all the work for you. Now in the shoot vlog option, you have various different setting options you can choose from. I believe they have dreams, they have memories, um, and each of them is a transitional choice that you can select from. And once you select the transition, it's as easy as just pressing the button and recording. I can't wait to see whether or not they're going to apply more updates and allow you guys to have more options. I think that would be a cool thing to really update on here is just to keep creating these types of transitions. Uh, but for the most part, super simple and I highly recommend you guys check out this feature on this device. So there you have it guys, the Xiaomi Mi 10 Pro 5G device. This thing is revolutionary, it's innovative, and it has the best features for you to create video footage and film like a pro at home. So I highly recommend you guys check it out, and if you are going to get it, or if you already have it, be sure to tag uh, shoot like a pro so that we can follow you guys online and see what kind of content you're creating. This is an amazing opportunity for you guys to get creative with a mobile device, really push your limits. And it's always about, you know, cost efficiency, about, you know, organization and making sure that you're not wasting too much time, always worrying about, you know, lenses and so on and so forth. Everything is here built in into a compact device, easy to utilize. And I'm super excited to have done this video for you guys. I hope you guys did enjoy it. As always, remember to like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys all next week. Peace.